Hey guys, it's uh, Tuesday, the 1st of December. Can you, can you believe it's December already? That's crazy. This year has just flown by. Anyway, um, I am off to work. I am driving in my truck today. I decided to take the truck today instead. I don't know why. I just uh, kind of had that truck feel about me today. Wanted to go out and drive a truck, a pick em up truck. So I'm in my pick em up truck. Oh, wow. Look at that. So, there's some road workers on the side of the road, which is kind of cool. Anywho, uh, driving to work, and uh, it's a beautiful day in California. Absolutely gorgeous, if you don't mind the smog. So, today's topic for the road is community vehicles. Vehicles in the home that are shared with various members of your family. Now, if you're a comparable height and weight to the person you share the vehicle with, then there's really no problem. No, no, the uh, issue lies when you are sharing the vehicle uh, with someone significantly shorter than you. Hint, hint. Now, the courteous party, uh, when they're done using the vehicle, they put all the settings back the way they were, expecting that the uh, next party to use the vehicle will uh, actually need them in a, uh, the pedals in a reachable location and the uh, seat in a place where they can actually get past the steering wheel. At the very least, put them in a uh, neutral location so that both parties uh, only need a slight adjustment in order to be comfortable. You see, some of us are <clears throat> uh, larger than others and uh, need that extra space. Then there are those that uh, just leave the settings in their preferred configuration and uh, say, darn the consequences. I was going to say, damn the consequences, but I figured my son might see this video. I just did. Anyway, I think that's kind of presumptuous, don't you? I suppose I could just uh, put the settings where I need them before I get into the vehicle and just shut up about the whole thing. But what happened to chivalry? You know, give and take, 50-50, what's yours is mine, what's mine is yours. You know, this is kind of like that toilet seat thing. So ladies, have a heart. Our lives are in your hands. Maybe I should start a support group for this. Hi, I'm Leo, and I'm a victim of a misplaced seat. Put the seat back, put the seat back, put the seat back. Anyway, that's how I feel about it.